One of the most popular Christmas carols in Italy is called Tu scendi dalle stelle. It's probably the most popular Christmas carol. And what the hymn Silent Night is for the rest of the world, well, this carol is for all of Italy. Although it is so popular, not everyone knows who the composer of this carol is. Well, it's an Italian saint, Alphonsus Liguori, who was born in southern Italy and the founder of the Redemptorist congregation, as well as he's the patron of confessors and of moral theologians. Alphonsus was a man who was so gripped by the love of God that he just wanted to pour it out in whatever talent God had blessed him with. He was a talented writer, he was a talented musician, he was a talented painter, and he used every one of these gifts just to communicate what this love of God is all about. He had four important pillars of his spirituality, the crib, the cross, the Eucharist, and Mary, or put it in other words, the crib as in the incarnation, the cross as in the passion and the death and the resurrection of Jesus, the Eucharist, and of course, Mary, to whom he was so devoted. But for Christmas, for him meant incarnation, God coming down to earth to becoming one with us. And for him, that was a tremendous expression of God's love for us. Alphonsus was a very dedicated priest and he worked with the simple and the poor people. And he wanted them and all to know that this is the nature of our God. This is the image of our God who's willing to come down from the heights of heaven to be just one of us. That was the extent of his love. A text from St. John's Gospel, chapter 3, verse 16, God loved the world so much. That phrase, so much, meant a lot to St. Alphonsus, because it spoke about God's abundant and plentiful love and redemption. What this carol tries to do for us is gives us a glimpse into the love that Alphonsus had, but more than that, it gave us a glimpse of the heart of a God who loves us, so much so that he leaved the very heavens to come down and earth and embrace us with his love so that in turn we will know this God who personally loves you and me.